best knows for biggest knows is that that's that's a hard one, eh? Because there's quite a few uh, boys. Everybody thinks it's me, but that nah, is it's uh, Mark Faulkner's nose twin. It's Brucey. Definitely Brucey. I think they were born like Siamese twins. My nose is that big. One was born in America. One had to be born here. <laughs> you touch across the Atlantic. The noses are that big. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a nose for pulling pickles out of a jar. <laughs> <laughs> few that think they're good looking. Okay. Bobby. They pale into insignificance when you see the man that has Ronnie Heard. Yeah. I mean his hair colour changes from week to week depending on what he's smoking that week. Depending on what wig he wears to the rink. Yeah. Or every given uh, home game. Depends if his iron's working as well, tire yeah. some of the wrinkles out eh? Yeah. Ah, he's Definitely best looking man I think. Yeah. His second hand suits are like the best, eh? <laughs> he's, uh, <laughs> he's got everything, he's the whole package. <laughs> oh, uh, well, best and worst nicknames, I suppose. Um, Killers had a few this year, eh? Um, <laughs> <laughs> Gru's probably the biggest uh, one, like, uh, Killer is the original Gru on the team. Mm -hmm. Sweaty legs. <laughs> 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 It's always me that's getting it. Aye, uh, who else? There's uh, Justin. Justin, definitely. Justin Dasgustin. It suits, it suits him pretty well, like Justin Dasgustin. Yeah. Well, Disgusting individual. <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> <laughs> no, I would say that's it. Justin Dasgustin's got the best nickname in the team. Worst dancers are an easy one, eh? It's the only, the only person that dances. There's could qualify for that. Jordan Fulton. It's, a, it's, a, it's embarrassing, eh? Like, guy's supposed to be an athlete, eh? He should have been a professional dancer, I think. Oh, he thinks he's got the moves. Ah, he's got nothing. Nothing. Doesn't bring anything to the dancing game at all? No. Nope. Stick to hockey. <laughs> <laughs> Biggest diva on the team. Wow. Well, uh, that by uh, easy. Like there's a few divas though, right enough we've had to deal with in the in the last three years in the elite mm -hmm. league, but one's the worst, like by far. Like and it has to be Ned Lukasevich. He thinks he's Sidney Crosby. Yeah, he's 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 near Sidney Crosby though. Well, if you see him on training, you think he's Bing Crosby. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, Bing Bing Crosby, like that's that's what he should be known as for now on. Sense of humour. Most uh, sense of humour is Tommy Muir. Yeah, Tommy Muir by far. Like he thinks he's the funniest man in the world. It's, it's, it gets embarrassing at times, eh? You gotta watch all the tumbleweeds flying about in the room. He kills a conversation, kills a night out, kills a bus trip. He's just he's no funnier. <laughs> <laughs> and it's the same. Like he, he thinks he can everyone run, like but uh, he's no funny either, eh? No. Likes to think he is though. There's not really any jokers in the team. They've all got terrible sense of humour. Right. Aye. Aye, they're kind of... They've no banter. Nah, lacking in that department, eh? Dumbest guy in the team was that. You'd be better than asking who's not dumb in the team. <laughs> <laughs> got a few guys that have got university degrees, or so they say. I think they paid some, some uh, girl to do all their tests back then, but... Or they got them at a cereal packet. Aye, so communication degrees, whatever that is, like, hey, like... I who, who has a degree in communications? Yeah. That's not even a real degree. Filling and real, eh? I mean, that says it all, eh? I think they're going to open up a mobile phone shop when they retire. But, eh, uh, dumbest guy in the team has got to be Jamie, yeah? Definitely. Torch. You just need to see some of his energies. You <laughs> think, think yours is going to be bad, eh? Like... <laughs> 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 He does a good impression of him though. So. <laughs> Most intelligent guy in the team? Tom, Tom uh, Muir. Definitely Tom Muir. 100%. Never been wrong in his life. Knows no. everything, eh? Knows everything. Never been wrong. 
can mark it up on the calendar if he's wrong. Ah, it's, n it's never wrong. It's never on the calendar. <laughs> <laughs> Or stress sense. A few. There's definitely a few. Uh, Knickers are weird, tires leaves a lot to be desired. I mean, any of the Americans and Canadian guys like have the worst stress sense. Mm. Tartan shirts and dungarees. But yeah, definitely I'd say one that's the worst of a lot has to be Bobby. Bobby Shumman. The Life guy, up. yeah. The guy's got no style at all. It's embarrassing. <laughs> Worst taste in music, it's, that's easy, yeah. Every Canadian, American, Serbian. It's this country music, like. Slova Slovenia, Sl Sl Slovenian. Slovenian, whatever, yeah. Crazy Russians, like, they just. It's all these country music, it's, it's all about your tractor and. Driving, my dog drove my pickup truck into my tractor, which <laughs> fell off a cliff. Uh, so it's not really music, is it? And that goes back to Fulton as well though, with his line dancing and that as well, yeah. eh? That's Fulton and Reber line dancing, yeah. It's, it's, it's bad, like, it really is bad. I think they practice in their flat. I think they I think they actually do. Yeah. And practice their line dancing in their flat. It's easy. He has to deal with them all the time, highest maintenance. Get it real. You think he played in the show? Uh. It's embarrassing. It's almost as embarrassing as his uh, goal celebrations. Him and Mariah Carey are pretty close. Yeah, it's aye. Easy. Take the real biggest deal. Hands down. The funniest moment of the year for me was uh, Justin disgusting face planting going on the bus on the last away trip. Cup of coffee in one hand and his mobile phone in the other, face planting. Hilarious. I missed it. <laughs> My best moment was in, uh, in Dundee after a game. Uh, Nickerson started eating babies. I think he ate five. I didn't see it like, but I heard it was definitely four. Yeah, definitely four babies. Yeah. But he does eat like a baby before pre game. Like, that's, that's his pre game meals, a baby. So I may as well get the truth out there, I don't know. Yeah. Or the other time when he allegedly threw a granny out of her wheelchair in Hull. I've seen that. And beat up the whole crowd. He beat up a few in the crowd, like 20 I think. What was it? Uh, 20, yeah. 20. So we're all in wheelchairs. We're all in wheelchairs, aye. We're all flying, <laughs> eh? Some say. <laughs> 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 This is the, by far the worst year for the worst hair. There's more guys going, I mean, thin this year, they're all catching up with Killer, eh? Yeah. And uh, we've been giving them tips, like, on what to do. I mean, there's Jordan, he's yeah. dirty him. Yeah. Ned Lukasiewicz, I mean, he must only have, like, five hairs left up top, eh? And, uh, he's going to get the Bobby Churl up in here, dude. Yeah, he's going, he's going to go for the comb over soon, eh? But we've been telling them, like... To rub porridge on their head. Wet porridge and rub it in. But it's not working for a lot of the guys, eh? Todd's looking a bit thicker, right? Todd's looking thicker, eh? I think he's been getting plugs, though. Lots of, por lots of porridge on that. <laughs> but worst hair, though, like, you have to pick one, eh? Hainsey. No, Hainsey's is the best. Do you think? Oh, it's by far the best. I think if he grew that up a bit more and dyed it blue, he would look like Mars Simpson. <laughs> <laughs> Hardest working on the team. A um, few guys like give 100% when they're on the ice. Like Fulton, Fulton puts 100% when he's on the ice, and a few guys try hard in the gym and stuff like that. But there's only two guys that really, did stick, it, really stick out. Do, do the same job, like perfect week every week night, week. week in, week out. Don't need to practice it. Nah, like, can never be blamed for losing a game. Like, just by far yeah. the best on the team, eh? No, oh, definitely. It's definitely us too, like. No, yeah. me and Stu. Just so professional, and I mean, we could get a job on the show, I think, eh? I think so. Definitely. Without transfer, a doubt. Transfer next year. Yeah, definitely us. NHL. NHL, next year.
Calgary Flames. <laughs> <laughs>